Hey GTI fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host Zelot, and we're here today doing the Alpha 9 Stable Branch. And we're just, you know, hanging out at the beach, enjoying the sun. It's a beautiful day, but time is ticking. So let's continue on. We've got to craft a base starter. So let's do that. And so base starter, and then it wants us to craft wood blocks and place them around the core. Well, normally I wouldn't do that, but for the tutorial portion, we will. Uh, and then I'll continue placing some concrete blocks and walls around that. <laughs> so we're going to need to make, what did it want? 20? 20? 20 or 10? 20. Okay, so that's spun up, and that's making the base starter, and then it wants us to place it around. So what I was planning on doing was not really powering up a base, even if it says to before we get an HV going, because I think that's a little bit folly. It's going to... It's going to it's going to get people killed if they're not ready for it. So I'm not going to do it because that's not I don't think that's the right way to do this. I think we need to get a HV going first. It's kind of crazy, but um it just I don't know, the the weapons, the hand weapons are so insignificant against the the drones now and they do so much more damage, especially if you're not wearing armor. You can barely take on one with an assault rifle, let alone two of them. You just can't out in the open. It's impossible. Because one, the, you can't get them both to stay together. They, they, they're smart enough to like separate from each other and just, you can't do it now. They're too tough. I mean, you can, if you're really good, but I'm not that good. So <laughs> it's just, I can't do it. I can't, I, I tried in experimental uh, and I, I, I just can't do uh, two drones at once without armor out in the open with an assault rifle at range of only like 60 meters or something. Okay, so it looks like we're both ready here. And I'm going to grab those. Oh, it's not going to let me grab all the wood blocks. Isn't that interesting? So... I, I have too much on me. Let's throw those in there. We'll see how much more we can carry. Not. Really? That should have been like 10. Oh, because each one's 16. Wow. Okay. So that doesn't really matter. Yeah, we'll just eat one of those for fun. Okay. <sighs> well, that's, that's fine. What we're going to do, we're going to place this down. We're going to get... Uh, Just want it barely in the water. Don't want it too far deep because yeah, something like that, something right about there. That's fine. I know I could have put it way down deep in the water and then built up, and but you know what. I'm going to, I'm, I don't want to sound like a jerk, <laughs> but I'm trying to build it like a newbie, okay? So I'm trying to experience this as a newbie, following what it's telling me to do. Uh, I might or might not know how to do this, but I do personally use the drone to build with because it's just better, although it's a little bit more twitchy. As long as where you're targeting doesn't move while you're clicking and the drone drifts, right? So that's the problem. Okay. Uh, so 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10. 
So it wants five more. And I think I'll make one more just to make that an even amount right there. I think I'll make one more. Okay, so let's drop our drone. So craft small generator, craft fuel tank. Now this is this is really scary thinking that that they're gonna get me to craft a fuel source and power source for a base before I even have like a decent weapon to defend myself with and made out of wood like are, are are they actually trolling people with this hmm let's see let's see so i'm not actually going to make a generator i do know that the oh we still got yeah seven blocks let's let's actually finish let's finish using these here let's get this let's get all these down so six we can get those down and uh, we'll put that one there there we go <clears throat> create a little bit of symmetry somehow and it also creates a little bit of line of sight for us which is fine okay so we can't actually pick up hardly any of these because they're 45 SU we only have I mean we can pick up a few Seven. <laughs> Put that back in there. Okay. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, we're getting too far from there. Okay. Although I, I should put down those other four just to even that out. I can't believe it's making us make that. What I'm going to make is a capacitor solar capacitor this should count towards the generator and then I'm gonna make solar panels I'm gonna end up making f uh, I don't know I got a decent amount of mats let's make five they're not too expensive they're not too too expensive and I'm not actually going to be placing this on the base, because if it says to place it on the base and fuel it up, then I'm not. Oh, yep, see it gave us it gave us craft small generator checkbox there, so that must have finished. Yep. We're just gonna stick that in there for now. Uh we we will place these, but we're not gonna place the capacitor because if we place these by themselves, they will charge up. And then eventually when we put the capacitor down, it'll be like this big lump sum of energy. It'll get a big shot in the arm from them. So that's what I intend on doing. I'm not actually gonna power up the base though. So I'm not putting the capacitor down. Um now the fuel tank thing power up the shelter unfortunately that's going to catch people this 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 is so misleading i can't believe they they're getting people to power this up because it's <laughs> if i if i did it i'll get drone base attacks right away i'm not going to do that i'm not going to do it so uh oh yeah we hit level four but whatever um so craft fuel tank, well, we're not going to do that because I'm not actually going to be using Okay, and craft fuel tank. We're done. Okay, so let's do the vehicle portion. And, oh, got too far from my, there we go. So it's almost done. Come on. Um, it wants us to make a starter vessel. Okay, that's fine. That's easy enough. Let's do that. Let's do that. So, do we have everything unlocked we're going to need to do that with? We should also put a cargo box on the base and probably expand that out quite a bit more. I can, um, let's grab our seven blocks at a time here and we'll just, we'll launch up. 
there. We can put this. Oops, this is going to pop me out. Nope. Oh, look at that. <laughs> I'm going to glitch, aren't I? Okay, let's. Yeah, that could have been risky business. Shouldn't have done that. That's okay. That's okay. We're okay. We can see everything. We're protected. Okay, that's fine. Um, realistically, I'll be using concrete for all the walls. I know they're up in the air right now, but we'll uh, we'll we'll actually brace all that. Uh, so grabbing seven blocks at a time. Okay. Okay, and then we want to go like this, there, and uh, I don't want to bury my constructor as of yet. So, well, as of never really, but let's just go like this and fill in that side. Okay, we'll continue to grab blocks here. I know it's really cumbersome to. to to use the heavy blocks at first here. Oh, that's not the one I wanted. Like that one. Okay. And then we'll get that. Oops. Stupid thing. That's fine. <laughs> Keep going with that. I'm probably going to have to move this constructor. That means shuffling everything over to the other constructor. And then doing the same thing again to move it again. That's not a big deal. Whatever. Probably have to move it all here. Okay, we've got a platform happening. So let's just keep building as much as... Oh, well, <laughs> okay. And... Okay, this is a little bit tedium. I'm going to come back when I've done doing that. I'm going to move these constructors and move my crap out of the way of the platform here. And we'll get this platform done. And then uh, I'll be back. We'll start crafting the... Uh, the well, I'll get that. I'll move all that and I'll start crafting all the stuff so that's ready to go for us. Okay. Okay, I'll be back in a, well, in a bit. <laughs> oh, geez, you know what? I, I figured I'd show you guys how to do this. I almost missed a critical part of the, of uh, how to do, like, transfers and all the, why. like, wow, I can't believe I almost, didn't show you guys this. So, okay, what I did was I, I was starting to move all the stuff and I'm like, oh, well, let's just make a cardboard box. And we'll, I'm like, oh crap, yeah, I put that on there and I'm like, we better show everyone how to do this. So I built a large cargo box. That was one of the things I had unlocked uh, for base item. It's, it's a level one item, it costs three points. You have to unlock that. If you wanna, if you wanna make life easy, unlock it, okay? Don't power up your base. Put a cargo box on it, like I've done, right here. Now, when you build the cargo box, it gives you a whole bunch of options when you go to place it down, what you want to place. So, right click, select whatever you want. The large one like this allows 16,000 storage units from it. <clears throat> you can also see that we have a Wi-Fi signal right now because we're standing super close to the base and it's got a core in it and it's ours. So what we can do is we can Wi-Fi signal in hitting F4. Right away, the only thing on the base is the cargo box. So it just automatically connects us to that because that's really the only thing. With a volume of 16,000, uh, I'm not sure what the map, it can hold 64 things, stacks, whatever, but at a max volume of 16,000 total. Um, 
So what we're going to do is we're going to take this and turn this into a kind of our, we're going to move everything into it sort of thing and then use it to, to distribute everything out onto the base and to build with. By Wi-Fi connecting into it, we get this, I guess it's like a virtual toolbar specifically for what cargo box you're connected to. And it tells you there. So, so just look down and see which Wi-Fi connected device you're connected to. And that's where those items reside. Technically, they, they're not, they don't take up 60, one of the 64 slots if they're in this toolbar. But as soon as you release your Wi-Fi or get disconnected, all those items will go into your into that um, Wi-Fi enabled cargo box. So um, what we're going to do is we can use it to actually we can use this bar to transfer between. So I can go like this. <clears throat> I can grab all these now and literally I can use that to build with now too, right? So that's how we put everything in there. But what I also want to do is I want to move these out of the way. So I'm going to grab all of this stuff because it's so freaking heavy. I can't really do it. But my, my base cargo box can. Yeah, I know it's, 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 it's a little weird, but... So there we have it. Then we go back into our Wi-Fi and we can just literally, we can disconnect and it'll just dump it all in there. So, okay. Um, if I, eh, you know what? I don't want to do that. Let's, um, <laughs> there are known issues right now with this build. So let's just not play around with that right now. Let's just not play around with that. That was some hard earned ore there. So I'm not going to play around with that. Normally I could just disconnect and it would all drop in there. But I, I, I don't want to play around with that right now. There's been some bugs with that. And I've been bitten by that more than once in experimental. So, okay. Uh, let's grab all our stuff. Let's grab it all. Put it down on the bar, and is that it for that? Yep. Okay. Cool. Um, so we can Wi-Fi in, and we can literally just dump all this in here. Okay. And then we can do the same thing to this one. Actually, this I can just carry, I think, most of that stuff except for that. Yeah, okay. And then we're going to grab both of these. Okay. And then we're going to grab this guy. We're going to come over here. Let's just... Is that going to be close enough? It should be close enough if we come right here. I kind of want to be in the water though, so I want to, we're getting cold, let's, let's place some of these blocks right now, just so that we know where to go here, okay, good, so now let's switch over to this, and we'll put our gear back down, put our gear back down, come on, oh, I had a pretty good spot, there we go, and then this one, I want to do it like right. I want to do it inside. I wish. Okay, that's not bad. And then we can put this down right here. Okay, there we go. We're st we're not freezing to death again, and we can now use our cargo box to build with. See, we still got eleven blocks here, so we can like. Finish this off. We 
get six more blocks. Um, I mean, I could just start doing the back wall pieces here. And oh, you know what? This should this should have went on this block. Oh, really? Okay. <laughs> and then now we need to put one on th that's going to be tough. Okay, I can't even see under there. So what we're going to do is we're going to do the connector base. Just makes things easier. And then we can just do that. There we go. Okay. Um, I'll have to get rid of those blocks with the survival tool if I do want to get rid of them. And then we can start putting blocks along here. Okay. Let's grab... Do we have everything else from there? I think we moved everything else, right? So... What do we got in here? We got 38 blocks. Okay, so let's continue with, oops. If I move too far, no, that's not too far. Excellent, okay. Okay, I I think this needs to come out further. Yeah. Give us a little bit more storage capacity and it's just gonna be a box for now. I know, I know. Another another frickin' box. Um You know what? Let's just let's just fill this right in here. Let's just fill this right in. And then we'll put the rest here. Okay. So it wants us to build a bunch of HV parts. So I'm going to get all this queued up. Not with the drone, dumbass. And so I got to grab everything again from the here, which is not that big of a deal because I just put it all down in the toolbar here. And see, I can't actually, I have to manually grab it all, but that's okay. That's okay. I got to put it all back in. Clicks in no problem. That's that's good. And then, how much of this can we actually carry? Wow, all of it. <laughs> okay. Uh, what do we want to put in there? This construction type stuff. It's garden, gardening type stuff. Okay. Okay, so now that we got our 101, 102, that's funny. Now that we got our solar stuff sorted, and we still got the connected base going, right? Yep. Okay. So we can, these aren't that heavy. So it doesn't, we don't need these in the connect to base thing. I just want to put them straight in here and we're going to, we're going to disconnect from the Wi-Fi just for a second. And then we're going to go place these and probably somewhere up here should be just fine. Out of the way of everything. Let's turn our light on. Sorry about that. OK. 
Okay, we gotta hurry with this because I'm already getting cold. So six, and let's just put them flat. Come on, over more. Come on, over more. Really? Really? Thank you. Yeah, we're just about to start getting cold. Too cold. Okay, let's run back. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on. They kind of nerfed the jumping too, by the way. <laughs> it just seems like they did. I don't know. Maybe th maybe third person is different. I don't know. Uh oh uh oh uh oh uh oh! Are you kidding me? Crap! We. We only got our shotgun. Okay, so. <sighs> and hypothermia. Thanks a lot, critter. <laughs> Driving me away from my. Uh, don't die. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh. Okay, so we're not protected here on this side. <laughs> Maybe we need to move our stuff over to the other side. <sighs> Darn. Well, let's, let's eat something. We're going to lose a lot of food here anyway. Because of the stamina loss, see how quickly the food goes down? <sighs> when the stamina is re when it's regening, it eats up food, so. Yep. Yep, that could have been deadly. <laughs> okay, so now, let's get this stuff going. Uh, where are we here? Let's get the, did we get the starter going? We need to get the starter. And then we need the cockpit. And generator, a couple fuel tanks. We're gonna need that's a base one. That's we don't need that. Uh, we need four of those. Okay. So how much I got? Lots of unlock. Points, but I'm only level four, so I can't make the. Wow, that's a lot of unlock points for doing those quests. That's good. Those quests are well worth doing that. Holy crap. <laughs> Holy crap. Uh, okay. Let's actually take that. We can. We're not going to be powering up a base anyway. Eh. Not right away. Let's take a look at hover vessels. I don't think we can make a harvest module until we can until we're like fifth level. So let's let's do cargo box. This is just gonna be a a shuttle, really. Because I, I can't even... Okay, so we'll make that. We'll learn that. We'll learn that. Because when I hit level 5, we'll be doing that. i got to learn that too then, right? Uh, we're going to learn that. We're going to learn that. To learn that. We're going 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 to need to learn that. 
Uh, detector at some point, probably. Let's take a look at miscellaneous. Let's do the wireless. I don't know if this, if the, nah, the survival, or the portable cannot make that. Too bad. Okay, that's fine. Um, what can that make? Portable constructor can make it. The large constructor in advance. Okay. Okay. What about tools? Should we do the... What does it tell us to do? It probably... It didn't tell us to do an ore scanner, did it? So I think we should do one. Probably make it too. Ore scanner. We'll unlock the multi-tool. Uh, weapons. Let's un unlock the assault rifle. Not it for now. Can we hold on to the points? 13 points. Detector, small vessel, capital, base, food processor, uh, large panels. I don't think the. Yeah, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We'll just hold on to those points. Okay, so we're just waiting on the hover thrusters, which it's just about to do. And then we're not going to power it up because we're not actually going to be able to build it today. This was more the getting the, the foundation here up and running and getting everything made and ready. So, yeah, do we have much more in the way of concrete? Yes, we do. We have a lot. So we're going to make a bunch more concrete blocks so let's go with let's go with a hundred okay let's let that finish crafting and I will be back okay so we have finished basically I'll show you we finished our box. <laughs> There's just a cargo, the cargo box inside there. And that's it. That's it. And then, oh, let me zoom back in because that'll be some weird. Okay. And the parts for the starter HV are ready. So that's exciting. So next episode, we're going to put this thing together and see if we can uh, uh, get it working without being completely useless. I'm hoping the four cargo boxes, because that should duplicate about what we carry on us, should help. So we should be able to carry double the weight and at double the speed. Um, so it it starts it'll start multiplying our our uh, material gathering capabilities by quite a bit by like four times or so really okay guys well i'm gonna leave it off here uh, i'm not powering up the base there's nothing in it it's just a cargo box in there i'm just using it as a uh as storage um next episode we're gonna build the hv and we're gonna I, I need to go around and get a whole bunch more wood right now, though. So that's what I'm going to be doing off camera and trying not to die. <laughs> yeah. Okay, guys. Till then, you guys have yourselves an awesome, awesome day.